A group of energy workers from the Wabash Valley are helping to restore power in the south after Debbie left many in the dark. News since Jaden Reeves joins us now live in our studio to explain what Indiana Duke Energy employees are doing to get people back online. Rondrell, 300 Indiana Duke Energy employees have made their way down to Florida and another 300 are in North and South Carolina. The crews they have sent work specifically on power lines. They stage the crews in locations where the storm has already moved through. According to Duke Energy, more than 330,000 customers were affected by outages in the south as of this morning. Rick Berger is the Duke Energy District Manager here in the Wabash Valley. According to Berger, within the first 24 hours of the crews being there, they had restored about 90% of those customers' electricity. We're proud of that. I mean, we couldn't got that last 10%. I mean, I understand, but we, that, that is a good number to look at. But it takes all of us to bring that power back on. Coming up at 6, we'll look into why Duke Energy crews made the long journey down south to help in these efforts. Back to you.